when I brought up, you know, free menstrual products, people were like, in Hickville, nowhere. You know, this isn't even the front range. Like, this is Western Slope. Like, and I was like, we're gonna do it. And we did it. For someone like me, I've had an experience, especially in middle school, where I didn't have anything and I was super unprepared. And you know, you have that walk of shame to the nurse's office. As like, you know, a young person in school, you know, knowing that like I've been through that and other people are gonna go through that. I really just like want people to be comfortable and know that if they go through something like that, that they're covered by their school and that they don't need to, you know, do that walk of shame to the nurse's office every time. I was doing SAT practice and I was like, I'm kind of bored. So let me, you know, look into period poverty and like statistics on those. And there was, you know, a study shown in a New York school that, you know, they provided free menstrual products and attendance went up by 3%. And, you know, 3% attendance increase doesn't seem like a lot, but like anything that can get students, you know, to get to school is a big deal. So I printed out those infographics and I brought them to school. I think I printed like six copies and I gave them to teachers and administration that I trusted and had experience with and that I liked basically. A few teachers told me that they would bring it up in meetings. And about a week later, you know, I get a call from the principal and I'm like, oh shoot, thought I'd have even a little bit of resistance, but I didn't have any. So this is a women's restroom here at Fruita, and this is what the dispensers look like. And you just press one of these buttons, and a pad comes out, or you can press this button, and a tampon comes out. So we decided to use Ant Flow, who is an, you know, an organization that offers 100% organic cotton um, pads and tampons, and their whole slogan is like, they give back. So for every 100 products we bought, they gave one to the community. And you know, we bought almost 9,000 products. So you know, that's helping a lot of you know, menstruators annually. These are free, and you can definitely see how many are in a bathroom. And immediately I saw you know, a positive reaction from students. You know, a day after they were here, five like, random people that I barely knew said that it helped them that day. So, you know, it's helping people every single day, you know, either they can't afford, you know, products every single month or they just forgot or they, you know, they weren't prepared for, you know, getting their period that day, so. A big reason why I was so passionate about adding these into the school was because, you know, it's just crazy that like we accommodate, you know, we have, toilet paper and paper towels, like we have to use those things. It's just crazy that we didn't have menstrual products. So I guess with the implementation of free menstrual products here in the school, I'm really hoping that other schools will catch on in the district, especially, you know, that, hey, like, this is really helping the students out. You know, attendance is hopefully going up. I know it'll help so many people, and I'm really hoping that this expands and grows.